Um, this is how you create a playlist to put onto your website. Um, first, you go on your internet browser and you would want to go to wikplayer.com. And then if you scroll down, you'll see multiple steps to do. You'll hit create new playlist. Um, you get to choose what kind of um, playlist you want. I'm going to do a mini player. And then I like this one. And you choose your color you want. And then you hit next. And then you, what you would want to do is you would to go grab the songs. You would go onto YouTube on a new tab. And then you will type in the song you want. You go on the song you want. And what you would do is you're going to copy and paste the you and then you label it. And then you can do as much as you want. This is just an example I did here. Well, whatever. You hit next. And then you get to choose autoplay, shuffle back. Um, you get to repeat it. How high you would want it to be. Um, and how, like, you want it to say. You hit done. And then you'll go back to Weebly.com onto the page you want to put it. You will go on the side and you'll scroll down, down to embed, embedded code. And then you put it where you would want it. And then you'll go back down to Wick Player. And you would want to copy and paste the URL it gives you. Okay, so if they can go back and add, like, even like export mine, if I give them those numbers, you have to do it manually. Okay, and then this is how you publish it. Then you'll click the page. And I'll start to play. And then maybe if you want to also create more things in your Readly, um, there is plenty of things you can do. You would there's different kinds of designs you can do, um, and you can change your design anytime.
um, you can do change the color of the design, but you can also you go down to pages, hit add page, and then you can choose a standard page, a blog page, or an external link. When on mine, um, I have a blog page and I put it under it as a side. And then it comes down and it, you let you have new posts, has different kinds of settings, and you get a comment on it. And when you want to add an image about it, um, let's say if I go down to my sandbox and I want to edit the image, I would hit add image. And then you can upload them from your computer. Hold it again. Funny money then, I guess. And sometimes it won't exactly fit. But it'll let you crop it and um then to get out of it you'll have to hit save. Um, and then maybe if you want to add one song on a page to play like a video, you could also, if you want to, you would go on to YouTube.com and then you would type in the song you want. And then you would want to copy the URL, go back to your Weebly, go down to the YouTube icon on the left hand side, drag it into the space you want it, and then might pop up a different video like this. What you would want to do to get the video you want in there, you would click on the top and then copy the URL Well, paste it. And then you click on the side, and your video is there.